fellas. Welcome back. Welcome, Welcome back to the Man's Playing Podcast, episode five. Yes, sir. We in the building. We got Tim. We got DJ. We got E and J. E and J. No boy chase. Jeremiah just in the building. What's going on, fellas? What up, what up, what up, what up? How's everybody doing? How's everybody doing? A little check, Man, everybody? Bless. Bless? Bless? Highly favored? Highly favored. Highly, highly mm-hmm. favored. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Cool, cool, Feeling cool. chosen. Feeling chosen. Feeling Melody chosen. Melody from heaven. What was the other way around? Mm-hmm. You gotta do the other one, bro. Yeah, you you gotta, gotta do the remix. You gotta got do it already. Oh <laughs> man! Oh man! We go. We gonna. We gonna find. We gonna figure it out. Man, um, but it. before we, we start, man, make sure you like, subscribe, comment. Um, shout out to also Melrose Podcast who allow us to come in here at the end of every month and record stupidity, and they actually. <laughs> They let us do and they it. They let us do it, <laughs> and they record it very well, I and they make sure. I ain't, you know, I ain't stupid. I'm retarded. Okay, okay. that's good. Roger. That. All right, Roger. That. Roger that. <laughs> hey, you know, that's good can't too. tell you what you are, but um, but yeah, man. Uh, make sure you, sh- you follow our socials, our individual socials, which are Don't in the script in the description below, and um, make sure you also follow our Black Development Network page and things like that. I miss anything, Tim. Nah. No, you're good. You're We're good? good. Okay, yeah, I'm good. Yeah, yeah. So uh let's go ahead and get started. Um the first topic was uh what's the what's the guy's name again? Oh. Uh, I call yeah, him Pastor just, Simp. Oh, Pastor Poppy. Pa- Pastor Poppy. Pastor oh, Poppy Don. Pastor Poppy Don. Oh hey. Um Master of Simpness. Master Simpness. So so let's give him some background. So DJ uh, over the course of the month, has been sivin- sending us stuff from him. Um, if you don't know who that guy is, he was the the brother that was. Uh, um, he was basically telling folks how to how to pay. Oh no, not how to pay. How you should pay women just to see them. Yeah, so he was like, you know what I mean? Uh, if you you see her, treat something like that. If you if you see, you're supposed to pay. Yeah, if yeah. you see, supposed to, uh, but it's if something like a motto he had on one of them. Yeah, if you um, ain't, uh, cash out her money Monday through Friday, don't ask to see her on Saturday. Yeah, some shit like that. So Ooh-wee. Ooh-wee. <laughs> that's that, that sounds like hey man, that sounds like a bill, dog. That I'm sounds like you. a bill. That man, sounds like a bill to me. Girl, I don't want to see. I want to see them goods. If I'm seeing <laughs> sweet uh, water, sending you money Monday through Friday. Yeah, oh, Monday man. through Friday, dog. Saturday. It's I don't see my check until Friday. <laughs> okay. Some people don't get paid for two weeks. <laughs> Bi weekly pay. Bi weekly pay? Wait, no, they send you money. Get, getting paid on the 15th and the 30th. Oh, <laughs> I got to give you my check and I don't get paid till the 15th. That's crazy. That's crazy. Fuck rent. That's um, crazy. You know. But it's, yeah, this this guy is simpness at his finest. And simpness come, at his finest. Come to the light that he is beating on women, and he is. Yeah. He's he's been beating on women. There's been some some reports of other women coming out. Um, there's one woman's face that was that was on there too that uh, she got beat, and um, which is which is super sad, man. We definitely are against domestic violence of any sort. Against it. Um, yeah. totally she put against your, it. Put her hands on you, damn whoop hut. I'm just playing. <laughs> <laughs> no, guys, we, we don't, uh, we don't, uh, yeah, we don't, we, we don't, don't condone, condone the defense. We don't condone, uh, we yeah. condone self defense, but we, we, don't, yep, we, don't, we, we don't, condone self defense, but we do not condone just domestic, women. yeah, yep. just randomly beat, especially if you're the one giving them money. That's a bad return to me. Yeah. <laughs> Give me, <laughs> Hey man, that's a bad return, so man. You, you gonna, yeah, uh-huh. you, yeah, to get out of my investment, I gotta beat your ass. No, that's bad. That's tough. I definitely. That's real tough. Um, just, you know, I, I've been listening to a lot of his shit. I've been listening to a lot of his shit, man. And, you know, my, my biggest point of it is, you know, I see a spectrum, bro. I, y'all know I don't, you know, I'm not a big fan of K-Sams, but I put them on the spectrum too, bro. Of, K-Sam. Of, of where, you know, shout things are just a, the, <laughs> shout out to Unk, that ain't God, Unk. that's Unk, that's Unk right there, Uncle Sam. Um, but, you know, I put them on the spectrum, man, where... It's it's starting to really get out of hand, bro. These these different cultures, the simp culture, but this hyper I, alpha masculinity thing that's kind of getting out of control. Where alpha I live beta in the, thing. I live in yeah, man. Yeah. I live in the balance. So I live in the balance where you know what I mean. I can coincide with women, and women can coincide with me, right. and things of that nature. And it's I leave it there. You know what I mean. I don't feel like I have to tell a brother, you know, especially men, bro, because all men already have it bad. We already have it bad. Where we feel like. We have to do certain things to get women's attention. We 
it's a must. And and mm-hmm. you know what I mean? Me personally, I've never ran into a woman that just said, hey, bro, you got to send me $100 even to get me to text you back or anything like that. I haven't. Right. You know what I mean? But, you know, the fact that you're going around <laughs> telling dudes that, man, that's that to me, that's enabling. Yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? And it's enabling a culture that's kind of toxic towards men and things of that nature. So. Yeah, bro. We can't do no wrong. I mean, well, no, we can't do no right. You we know? can't, yeah. We can't do no right. Yeah, no and right. there's, yeah, man, it, it has nothing to do with his bank account. It, and that's the one thing I hate, too, this broke, he's broke, oh, he must be broke. Because someone doesn't want right. to give you their money. He's broke, They're yeah. broke. He's, he's broke just because he ain't want. He's paying his bills on time. Yeah, he bro. he has everything taken care of. Yeah, he's trying to say. And you're you saying know. he's broke because yeah, he doesn't want to give you money, bro. Like, Apparently, she's part of the bill now. You know, like no, bro. Comcast did not tell me. It's, like, <laughs> I gotta, I'm sorry, like, man. Like, like, like I really want to pay for dinner. You know, for yeah, man. And some dudes. That's why some dudes don't want to. You know, some. And we could talk about that too, man. Where some dudes just don't. Like it's like, man, y'all begging us to pay so much. We don't want to pay anything now. Mm-hmm. It's like we don't even want to because you're begging for it, you yeah. know. And that's where it starts. It's not you're attracted to me. It's not, you know, I've seen you around and mm-hmm. I like the way you, you know. There's certain places where I take it before I, hey, you're you're a handsome guy or something like that. It's like, no, bro. Hey, man, you want my attention? He, yeah, yeah. Go ahead and put that two hundred dollars in there. Mm. Exactly. And I think that's, that's crazy. Not th- I think that is why. Jays right there, dog. <laughs> that's that's some Jays. Crazy. Some Jays. W- would you consider that like prostitution? I mean, apparently not. Is it? Is it by def- de- Is it by definition? Yeah. By definition, that is really like prostitution, like paying a woman. I would call it pandering. Thing. If it's if it's because there's like a girlfriend experience too. Where it's like you don't have to like even smash. I'll just be like girl. You can. Is she. You just paying her to be your girlfriend. Pretty much, you really are almost like some sugar daddy stuff. Really? Yeah. What's love got to do? No. What's that? What's that movie? Which one? Love Cannon. don't cost a thing. Love don't cost a thing. Yeah. Boom. She was paying her. No, no he, he was paying her. He was paying her. Yeah. Okay. Actually, no, they worked out a deal. Actually, but it was, it was but, another way around. They worked out a deal because he, she needed her car fixed. He was he paying it. Popper, but they, they just put that behind, so they wouldn't think that it was right. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah. So. I wouldn't. I well. I wouldn't call it prostitution because I think prostitution is in you know you are getting sex. Yeah. And not these. Like I said, like they're saying, you're not even guaranteed. You're not even like guaranteed that. You're guaranteed uh, just attention. But mm-hmm. well, honestly, and attention sex, is is uh, is prostitution still is not just based off sex too though. You, they pimping women out just to be their girlfriend. Sure, I, w- I would say like like escorting. You can say escorting, escorting. but like not prostitution. Like prostitution escorting. is for the act of se- sex. sexual needs. Yeah. Escorting is the new. It's more of like it's the. I, I want your attention, everything. some type of attention, because not all these women are even out right. here having sex with these dudes. Mm-hmm. These dudes are like giving me going on dates. They, they yeah. just yeah, that, they're just going yeah, on covered, dates. Escort covers the whole realm basically. It could be like yeah, for sure. escorting. Yeah, but yeah. prostitution is like no, nah, bro. I paid you a hundred and. Fifty dollars and need, you giving me the need pussy. Right. Yeah, I need all that right, right. now. But these right. dudes are paying for other things to go to. And that's a, and that's What's a, that and, video? He pulled out his wallet. And like I was telling, t- <laughs> <laughs> and like, and, hey, I, need, <laughs> I need that right now. <laughs> and like I was telling Tim, man, I was like, you know, I never really seen an issue with sim culture because it was so minimum. Like, like to actually run across a dude that's just like doing most of that's like elitist, like rich mm. people. Maybe like a little bit of you know the hood dudes like but most of the time we're in relationships we're not just paying for it. I I ran into most dudes that just like nah bro she just gave me the pussy for free just cause I looked like I look or I had a car or some shit but nowadays like the sim culture is kind of like a little overbearing on on social media. Hey, it's a little, it's a little, it's crazy, it's crazy to me. Pay me. Yeah, pay me, pay me for the sex, y'all, y'all. Y'all, y'all on that? Y'all on that train? No. What, paying for sex? I'm not paying for sex, but just like paying for, not even just sex. You, hey, bro, I think you're beautiful. Yeah, I, I said. You I think she's know. beautiful. So you send her she's $50. Like, she's like, hey, bro. Yeah. You send her nah. $50. You so fine, he go $50. Nah. 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 Not know, just because she fine. Nah. Nah. Yeah. Nah, nah. nah. You know how many girls, you know how many fine girls there are, like just on Sorry. Instagram, like for free? Right. <laughs> like, I can look at. <laughs> well, I say in person too. Like I said, I've never had to. Empty my pocket. I did it because I wanted to do it. Versus mm-hmm. like, and that's what we're like telling mm-hmm. men, like, bro, like you don't. If you ever felt like you 
that's what we're saying to the women too. If you ever felt like you have to do something, like a girl can have a price. I'm not, I can't argue that. Like some women have their price, but I would say, I don't want to do that. You know what I mean? To me, that's desperation. That's to me. Like I feel like I have. Yeah. It's a little bit of I don't feel like I have. You know what I mean? I feel like I don't have a choice type of thing. Yeah. I feel like that's a part of being thirsty right there. If you feel like you is Same like thing. a man, like you're paying. Like I'm paying you money just to talk to me. I feel like he's thirsty. Yeah. Like if you if your average, not even just your average, Desperate. if your looks, yeah, your good Desperate. charisma, whatever personality cannot attract a woman to want to actually talk to you. Yeah. And you're thirsty, bro. Desperate. That's thirsty to me. Yeah, yeah. Desperate, Desperate. Thir- like mm-hmm. that shows that to me. Yeah. Like I, I, but women look at it as like, oh, he can't. Really? He cares because he put money in your pocket. And that's what you were saying too. Like this guy's like clearly beating women. Like there's. Right. A, you know what I mean? With, yeah. So and that's one thing I will also say to women, bro. Like, most of the time, and not saying, like, a dude wanting to do something, wanting to invest, there's a difference between wanting to invest and then there are men out there that literally throw money expecting you to act a certain way. Right. You get what I'm saying? Like, there are men out there, like a poppy, I don't know if he does this or not, but, you well, obviously he does yeah, this yeah. or not, but just putting money in women's hands. And he has an expectation of you. Mm-hmm. He just bought you. I see that as, like, property. Yeah. You know what I mean? He has bought you. He he literally sat there and he bought you. Yeah. Um, you know the crazy part and, about that? Yeah, man. Some women would sit there and say, I don't mind being his property now. Nah, he paid. Yeah, that's that, that's why. They say what? That's I don't mind being their property now. Like, you really yeah. got some women that'll probably be like that. Like, oh, he didn't pay now, so I don't care. Like, they wouldn't mind being property, like you're saying. They wouldn't mind. That's wild. Out. That's, that's mm-hmm. the wildest. Yeah, that's wild yeah, as hell. You gotta think about a lot of these. Well, I ain't trying to disrespect them, but these a lot of these housewives, mm-hmm. they get paid by their husbands just to be at the house, take care of the kids, and da, 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 da. they ain't doing nothing else. So mm. how they got money? Yeah, their husband is paying, paying for, for them everything to act a certain way. Mm. Sure, mm. take okay. care of their kids, mm-hmm. take care of the house, make sure everything's straight. Is there? Is, do y'all feel like that's an? Do you feel like that's an issue? Nah, hell, that, she want to be a housewife. She want to be a housewife. I mean, yeah, that's yeah. all cool and well, but but, some you, of these but women, you're saying, yeah, but you're saying that like that's a that's a thing. Like, yeah, that's, that's actual, a thing. Yeah, that's thing. Mm-hmm. so they do, can't do go nowhere know. else. Mm-mm. Not let hey man, say I so. I have met a wo- I have met a woman that even though she worked for she did work for Sears and she was at home, most, she couldn't even come out like her, and when she did come out. That dude was blowing her phone up. Like, yeah. as if she was out here sucking <laughs> That is control. Sheesh. <laughs> yeah. I know some niggas You get like what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. And so, yeah, it kind of, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like that, and she does, she says he takes care of the bills. She, He's doing everything in the, you know, in left, state, left, right man. field. Because like, he, he paying for everything and doing, like, he, she has to do whatever he says. Mm-hmm. She and there's some men that feel entitled no to that. Yeah. Yeah. There's she some men that out. absolutely. No, that's so that's true. why I tell women like, yo, be be careful what y'all wish for because like <laughs> right. you you saying you that wanna you want to pay all the bills, but then when he started controlling you, then what? Yeah, you know what I mean. Mad. She yeah. want that. That's and that's wild. This to should me. be a partnership. <laughs> no, 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 no. You sure? Hold on, bitch. I pay the bills. Exactly how I it pay be. for your hair to get done. I got the I lion shit. Where you going? I pay for that car. I pay for this. And you think you gonna talk to me like that? Oh man. Hey, the women better watch for those. Yeah. They be the one. They be the ones. They be the ones out there, like you know. But they ain't them. gonna see that red flag. They ain't gonna, they gonna see, see that red flag. Mm-hmm. I, hey, it's too late by it's then. Too, it's too late by then. Like you said, he, he coming across your they head like there. Poppy. Right. <laughs> 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 Boop. Go to Sky yeah. Daddy. The fuck. Oh, like, <laughs> Man, interview with Sky Daddy. Man. Hey, you and your one on one interview with Sky Daddy, bro. You, hey, man, it, it is what it is. Now, what if we learned? <laughs> it's like, what if we learned? I can go back. I can no, go back. No, 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 no. No, 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 no this no. is not a call. <laughs> what did you learn? You are up here. Yeah. <laughs> you up this here. is happening. Yeah, yeah, go to the bench. Oh, you might man. get a restart. Oh. <laughs> put you on the bench. <laughs> no, that's wild. But yeah, yeah, man, just just be careful, ladies, man. Like. You know, it, it's it's a lot of it's it's cool for a dude to have money. It's, we're not arguing that like dudes can have money and things like that. That's yeah. great. That's that's actually something like needed, right? Yeah. But at the same time, bro, you got to make sure like a lot of y'all are just taking this money and there's no insurance on you guys' end. Where well, let me make sure he's not controlling. Let me make sure he's not crazy in the head and stuff like that. Do you that. feel like it be the other way around? Though? What? 
They could be switched. They could be swapped. That a woman gives a man a lot of money and she expects to control him and things like that? Yeah. Is that what you're saying? Yeah. Sure. I think, I, think I think any role can, can be switched. I think it can, but it won't because women... Women have like a more emotional... Uh, when it comes to like investing, I feel like women have a more emotional barrier where men are more prone to see it as a business transaction, seeing it as a... It's always a transaction, but there's a difference between business transaction. Like I, I just think a woman doesn't want to take care of a man like that. Take like, I mean, you got to well, not, uh, not want to, not that's want to, but I've definitely know women that have taken care of men. Like yeah. they live on the couch. Oh man! Like they on the couch, not doing not a damn thing, and taking money from her, her car. Yeah, of course. Riding around in her shit. Yeah, there's some no shit niggas like that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I don't know, but I don't know if they want. I don't think there's a want. Nobody wants to do that. Like what? Who? Even like the dude that's beating her, bro. Like okay, the dude that's beating her, he realizes like. If I am going to do this, it's going to happen my way. So is that a want to do it? Mm-hmm. Or is that a, like, I I think this is necessary for my life. This is what I need. I don't know. That's for scary. That's even that scary. is scary. Oh. That's scary to think about. But right. that's that's kind of the, the <laughs> gist of it. Yeah. Like, you know, yeah, I, can, you I, don't, have to. I don't think nobody wants to do it. I think everybody wants to come together. I don't know. I'm a little naive, too. I think, I think differently. So, like, I would think that most people want to come in 50-50, which is also an argument, too, that I feel like yeah. it's so crazy to, like— that a concept of that, you know what I mean, of a 50-50 argument or, I don't know, 70-30 or something like that. But you know, it's evil evil that been said. So I recently seen a young lady post, Mm -hmm. like, you know, saying that somebody was like, all right, if if he taking care, if he paid for the movie, I got the popcorn, that type of deal. Sure. Yeah. And she was like, she was like, she said it's fake. She said that lifestyle is fake. How's it fake? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Fake. Like, how can how can a woman sit there and even say that lifestyle is fake? Like, that's you not you're not even trying to give life to it. Right. When, like, women is not trying to give life to that fifty fifty round. Like, they want to be equal, but at the same time, when it's time to pay bills, when it's time to take care of all this different stuff, I think I think I realize like in life, like, there's nah. no such thing as equal. Like, I don't right. I don't walk around and think that I'm equal to Tim or E. I think it's about what's fair. So, like, for example, when we talk about, I don't know, we talk about, like, business or something like that. I'm not, you might not pay for certain things, but what you bring to the table is fair enough for me to give you a fair, like, you bring some type of source to it in order for it to, you know, manifest into something great, things like that. You get what I'm saying? You bring something to it. And that's where me and that's so crazy. And, yeah, and I feel like that's so crazy. Like, we even talk about, like, the table, right? Like, mm-hmm. the fucking table. And it's like, I am the table. No, 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 you're not. You're like not. You're, you're, you're I'm walking a whole up human. to it, and yeah. I'm walking up Yeah, to the, it. the table is an entity in which we put things on. <laughs> <laughs> right, <laughs> Nobody right. is the table. I don't even put myself in that. Like, no, I'm not the table. I am the person bringing something to it. Hey, and like, so I don't, like this. I said, like, that type of that yeah bro like yeah bro I'm putting something on it you know what I mean if you're walking around that's entitlement to me like that's entitlement like you have not worked a day in your life that you feel like you should walk into any relationship and just and just be the entity that the person that partner got to take care of man or woman like I just don't feel that way well I'm taking care of his kids great you both two takes two to tango Mm -hmm. and you both proceeded to have a child right that's still 50 fucking 50 so, yeah, he has to do certain things. Yeah, if he's at work 60 hours, yeah, bro, sometimes I'm going to have to come home play play with the kid. Of course. <laughs> I'm not going to just go into the bedroom and go to sleep all the time. Of course. There's yeah. going to be times where I may have to do dishes. I may have to do yard work and things of that nature. Bro, that's a part of the 50-50. Like, you know what I mean? That's just how I feel. I don't know how y'all feel about that. But, all right. So how you feel about if... I take care of the yard, you take care of the inside house. Like sure. Man take if the man take care absolutely. of the outside, yeah, woman absolutely. take care of the inside. And then you yeah. know, some women love yeah. gardening and, and are very good with a green thumb, so I can understand that too. But yeah, absolutely. Man, I'm mm-hmm. mowing the lawn, I got the, the shed in the back and I just feel know. like the relationship will be better overall if if there's like a yeah, well, not a partnership, but just more of like working together. Yeah, like, yeah. A, a coexistence. Yeah, a instead coexistence. of just like I do all this and yeah. you do nothing. I don't think you exist in a relationship if you're doing. doing if nothing? that dude is doing all, I don't yeah. think you you are there. Yeah, you're just there. But you are you do not exist. Like yeah. you do not. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, bro. When people approach you, like they're like, bro, you. I don't see you going out or anything like. And like I said, again, females, if you are ladies, if you feel as if you want that type of relationship, you get it. I can't argue with you. I'm not going to argue with that. But the more healthier relationships that I see, the ones that they are 50 fucking 50, mm-hmm. they are, there is a coexistence where both people 
exist. There's a there's a jot line down there where they both do certain things, mm. and maybe the role sometimes gets switched. Sometimes the dude gets you know hurt or he loses his job or something like that, and the woman has to to take over another role until he gets back on his feet. But isn't but it no, crazy that it takes for a man to have to lose something for the woman to want to step up? I think that's crazy too. I think that's a yeah, that's a fair. That's a good point. That's a fair. Like, that's yeah, a fair yeah. point. Man, like no matter mm-hmm. what, the man has to be you know provider like ground. Even he has going to be ground into the relationship, zero. yeah, he ground has to be zero, a ground zero provider. She can have she can a hundred thousand <laughs> in the bank. Mm. He is and she, provider. Yeah, <laughs> like, she can lose her job today. It don't matter because he was still was he was the still, provider. And I think that's a like that's a male quality. That's a masculine quality where. Mm. We see our woman down. We come in. Right. Save, we save the day. Fuck. We come in. Yeah. yeah. And we want to save the day, right? Real it's shit. a little bit of, yeah, man. Mm, I mean, I you, we want day. that, bro. Yeah. When you go out to your girls, man, hey, I lost my job last week. This man didn't budge. <laughs> yeah. He didn't feel, like, okay, cool. you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah like, you know, he might have had a talking, but he ain't budge. Them exactly bills. like, what we going to do the next? The light's still on. Yeah, what we going to do next? The light's mm-hmm. still on. The You know, whatever happens, you know, until right. she gets man, her man back. Man lose his job. I was like, girl, I don't even know why the hell I'm I am with this talk man. to this man. He, <laughs> oh, man. I don't know why I'm with this man. Right. Like, he, just, like, he just didn't put in 80 hours. He can't keep her job. He always switching jobs. You ass to get smacked. <laughs> but you know that's you I'm know that's a I'm that real. is a that is a conversation that I see happen to like yeah. it was with certain women I get <laughs> um I had a, I had an argument with a, with a young lady on Facebook well it was a couple of ladies and again like I said I don't argue like what you want I argue what is plausible like what is real like mm-hmm. what is actively going on in people's lives and so um young lady was asked uh was uh it was a 50 50 conversation and I said, well, in my realm, I said, most 50-50 conversation work. They work. Like they, cause, because basically you're balancing the scale in the, in the partnership. You're balancing the children. You're balancing the work. You're balancing economy. You're balancing all that. So if an economy falls or whatever happens, and like you said, like a coronavirus happens and people start losing their job, there's two people in the house. So there's two opportunities. Two opportunities. Yes, that's, a great, that's a great word. Two opportunities in the house versus one dude going out and trying to find it, being stressed out, yeah. and things like that. And then there's a woman sitting at home. Chilling. Chilling. That, br- that builds animosity, bro, and it, no matter that, what. That does. Because it's like the man, he's not as, we have pride, so it's like, I feel like I should be doing this. Mm-hmm. So, But at, at the same Puts time, I'm getting tired. On. You know yeah. what I'm saying? I'm wearing, and so tired, I'm not going to express bro. that to my woman, though. You come home, she's still watching building. more. Right. You come home, <laughs> the bitch is still on more, right? <laughs> It's right. like, God damn, it's the same episode. Like, yeah. shit. <laughs> exactly. Like, come on. Exactly. Talking about, well, we'll take care of the kids. And I had this yeah. argument with somebody, too. And I said, I said, listen here, bro. If you live in the United States, I don't know about it. You live in the United, United States. States. To me personally, by the age of five, that kid is going to have friends, mm-hmm. other villages. And, and I even look at our family, too. <laughs> like, we have villages. We've had villages mm-hmm. growing up. Yeah. And so it's not just on the parents either. You have a whole network behind you. Helping you take care of this kid. Staying at home and taking care of the kid past five is ridiculous to me, personally. Yeah. Yes, there you can educate them. Yes, you will have times to to be at home and be around the kid and things like that. But you ain't gonna miss shit. Right. He's five years old. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? You have you should have some type of support system, in, in yeah. my opinion. You should have some type of support system. So mm. you telling me, well, I'm I'm at home nurturing him. No, you're not. You're at home babying him. You're at home. I wouldn't even say babying him, bro. Like, he's playing with toys and shit. Like, he should be in daycare or preschool or, you some know what I mean, or sports, kindergarten five. You're in kindergarten. So, yeah, that should be. Sheltering him. Sheltering yeah. him. Oh, yeah. Or yes. I would say even sheltering herself from an, from an outside world. You get right. what I'm saying? Yeah, I want to And outside. so, you know what I mean? I even we look at myself. outside. I, yeah. <laughs> hey. And even, and even worse, <laughs> the, the worst conversation I also hate is we when outside. they go. When they go, oh, we can, I can create a business. Bitch, if you don't shut the fuck up, we'll create a business. Create. Yes, bro. I've I've literally uh, I've I literally got a PhD. sat there. Oh man. I've but, literally sat so there and they're like, there. well, well, since we're at home, we can create a business. And what I'm like, business? have you ever thought about creating a business? No. Nope. Like I even get mad at dudes that do that. She just saw somebody on Pinterest creating a business. <laughs> <laughs> she, saw a business. she saw someone on Pinterest doing eyelashes and said, I can do that. Yeah. It's like, you get what I'm saying? You can try, but come on. That's Never not what, but that there's so much. Like and people, la- these last tech ass. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, I've just seen so lashes. many lash tech women just pop up out of nowhere. Yeah, yeah. And everybody bundles. does lash tech. Lashes everybody does nails. Everybody yeah, like does. Lashes. And if that's your grind, and if that's your grind, cool. But like, you know what I mean? How many of y'all are really taking that seriously to the point where <laughs> you're making enough money to sit your butt at home? <laughs> if you're doing any business, you're not at home. Yeah, yeah. Any business, right, yeah. you're not at home. You're not right. at home at home. Right. You get what I'm saying? Unless you may be doing hair. But outside of you still creating your clientele, you're still doing you're pictures. Still, yeah. You're still doing so much. And I'm talking from like people that I've actively seen make buku money off of those businesses. So mm-hmm. there's no sitting down. There's no even you're not monitoring that child. So right. you know what I mean? Yeah. So like that's that's just what I hate. Like, you know what I mean? The fifty fifty argument is not a bad argument. No. It's just yeah, man. Women new, just don't like it because it means they gotta step up and handle business too. Yeah. yeah, and some no, women are lazy, bro. You yeah, gotta be like real, like yeah. some men are lazy, but women are lazy too, bro. And yeah, it's easy because they can be. Yeah, exactly. Right. Everything exactly. is basically not, like not to can. fuck with me. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Shit. You know what I mean? And, I, and, 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 too, and I feel that about. suit. I feel that. I feel that as well, bro. The first things when I date is I ask about the first date. I ask about futures. Where are you going? Where do you see yourself? Yeah. Yada yada mm-hmm. yada. I would expect you to ask the same thing. What type of money I bring? Can in, you cook grits? Like, that's a Girl. big one. Can you, no, no. you need you, you need grits? grits. Can you cook a boiled egg? Oh man, can you boil eggs? That's wild. I need some grits. But for oh, me, that I, I'm grits. not even I'm not I'm worried about saying. that because I simple. guess I guess because I'm also to a point where I, I, I love a family. We can cook like a mother. So yeah, I can cook, but. I also <laughs> I also feel like that's a learned skill. Like cooking is not yeah, it's a learned skill. So I, I don't really use that as there. I could care less. You can care could, less about yeah. That's just less. not my mo. Like I can care yeah. less if she can make grits. I can make grits yeah. type of shit. So I, mean, I know how to follow directions. Uh, yeah, oh, basically, <laughs> like goddamn, <laughs> how hard is it? Cooking, but you know, what I mean? <laughs> I'm just less. I'm just saying I don't care less about that. I care more about the ambition, the family's future, us pushing us. You know, pushing us for. I, right. I'm gonna be real, bro. I can't come home to you just sitting there on the couch. It's gonna be tough every day. Yeah, bro. Like, tough. of course, everybody has off days. But yeah, I definitely have. Yeah. yeah, bro. If I keep, every day. if I come in every single, and you just work day, your ass off. And I mean, I just closed a deal. I just, <laughs> I just flew from here to here. I just See, did all that. Even for the normal niggas, I just, home. I just dropped fries for eight hours. Yeah, I just dropped. Yeah, I, fries. I, I gotta <laughs> come home. I gotta come I home. Just, you I just on the built. Couch, I just built. Bed, like. <laughs> Why just, you come home so late from work? <laughs> I be dropping fries all day. And you sitting on my fucking couch, man. Still. I just, I literally just built a new stadium for the Braves. You know and you I mean? telling me <laughs> that I get to come home? Ooh, baby, guess what happened? Guess oh, what Murray. happened on the stu- on the on General Hospital? Guess what happened? Oh, you think I want to hear that shit? Nobody wants to hear that, baby. Is it if it ain't the, if it's the same shit that happened Monday? I but know. Eric just shut the fuck up. <laughs> like no, that is no, that is a no no for me. It's gonna get abusive. It's gonna get abusive. <laughs> it's gonna get- it's just, with Eric, yo, bro, yeah, I'm gonna go in the room. And, I'm gonna go in the room and cry, bro. And and you know what I mean. And ladies, we're really just trying to tell you, like, that's really like a part of like our depression. Like we're telling right. jokes and and things like that. But that's really like a part of a lot of dudes' depression. We want to work. Mm-hmm. We want to put the effort in. But if we come home and there's no other effort anywhere else in the house, where we feel like is as a single dude, if I can do it by my, that's not effort to me. Right. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You gotta go. Like I should, I should be able to clean my room. <laughs> like, it's, it's like we want, we want to see effort put into us. Yeah, if not we gotta put, we gotta put out so much Big effort, facts. put out so yeah, much bro. this and this. It's like, like you said, it's just like the small thing. It would be something small. Like I come home, I don't want to come. It ain't even matter. Like oh, come home to a clean house. No, we don't care about that. Because if you go. <laughs> We gonna have to clean that house. house. Yeah, if you don't, don't exist in our realm, like yes, we gotta take care. We gotta take care of that. So it's like something small. You come home like a back rub, or just like you cook dinner, like mm-hmm. something small like that. I don't care if the house got there clean. Some I top. need something smart, some top. Yeah, some microwave. <laughs> get some if microwave. I gotta talk, if I gotta ask you when I come home, can I get some head? We got a problem. Oh man, we got a problem. You should, you should look at my it's face. Ass, you should look at my face like I'm. Uh, you saying that it's just like period. off of, off of just a regular work week. Just a regular work week, like uh-huh. just you should kind of. You should look at your general. man. You should look at your man. You make the eye contact. Ask period, dog. Yeah, he's stressed out. Let me help you out. You gotta ask. Period. You should have to ask. Should have to ask. A man, that's the smallest thing a man can get. That's true. Women small, do, small. women do, women do access to be more mind readers and things of that nature as well. So it's supposed to be, you know. supposed to be. 
But are they though? Exactly. No. I don't read between mm-hmm. lines, but I'm supposed to read Bitch, your mind. I don't read yeah, between I, weave. I, oh, <laughs> man. Oh, man. <laughs> and that's a week in the Yeah, that's a week in the books. <laughs> a week in the uh, book. In a year. That's a year in the book. <laughs> Hopefully you support us. Support the channel. <laughs> Holy shit. We'll see y'all um, next year. That's it. We'll see y'all. That's all right. Yeah. yeah. Yay. We're talking about weaves and bundles. Oh, man. Oh, man. It's a wrap. Oh, man. It's a wrap. I almost took this headphone off. <laughs> and, and y'all I was so close. I was like... And y'all gotta go back to Atlanta. Oh, oh man, man. But the oh. most weed I said, city. I said, oh, hey, I weed did like that. I was like, shit. Goddamn bundles. And I, hey, hey, look, check who's saying that, okay? Don't don't come to my shit. <laughs> <laughs> go there. Go there. Hey, hey, he said that. EJ. Go to EJ. 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 Underscore. Make sure y'all got that camera on that <laughs> motherfucker. <laughs> you see him? Yeah, make sure y'all can see him clearly. Man. But uh, I like, like I said, man, though. communication. One thing I realized, even from both sides, like men and females, <laughs> I, I said that shit so often, bro. Like, you communication are. just don't. Be there. It's like this fucking barrier yeah, when problems right. come up. When problems come up. And it's like, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's my biggest thing, and I said this to Tim too, it's like I just feel like men and women are just like talking past each other. Right. And a lot of t- and like, you know what I mean? It's not a like a it's a tit for tat. Right. And I don't like that. I'm not about to tit for tat. You need to be transparent, to, bro. Yeah, be transparent. Be everything you, should be just up Everything front. should be up front. What it is. What it is. It this is, is what it is. You but know we can't, I mean? bro. We love but the hide shit. We do, we do love Especially the hot shit. Especially as men, we love the hot shit. We do. You know what I'm saying? We love the hot shit. Let me we see the hot phone. You ain't got no hot shit. Are y'all good? Yeah, we good. We good. We good. We good. We good. I can't see mine. Y'all like that? Bro, I do not well, do that well, toxic yeah, shit. Bro, I just, yeah, bro. I'm you. not no. I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be so honest, bro. Uh-uh. Bro, I'm at the age. I'm, I'm 20. I don't want to see your phone. <laughs> I'm a, and that too. I'm gonna be honest with you because I'm not. Not yours. I'm saying like my partner. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't. I don't. Oh care, man, don't do, you, do you ask for that? No, no. Ask for I've never asked for no. a woman's phone. I've never, I've never asked I've for never a woman's had. phone either. Nah. I feel like I could be real. real. I could be real. I had one, two, on two women that I ever, ever asked. Let me see your phone. What'd you ask for? Me, what was uh, the reason that you asked? Oh, because she was being sneaky. I knew she was cheating. I just wanted to see how she was going to oh, act. Oh, man. He knew. I knew she was going to Oh, act. you just wanted to see her reaction. Yeah. So, okay. So really I'm going to ask you the same. Yeah, I I'm going to ask really you the care. same shit I asked in the lift. That's toxic. What? Okay. You you already knew it, though. You already, you could. Yeah. It came out. Okay. No, no. So it what, didn't come out. I mean, not I come did, out. Excuse you know. me. I'm sorry. Right. It, but you knew. Yeah, in your head, in head you were already like, this motherfucker cheat. Yeah. So why? So how long did it take you to ask for the phone? Oh, the same week. I don't, I don't oh, play the same, no game. The same I week? I don't play no game. When I tell you, I don't I was do that gonna toxic ask... shit. I don't do that toxic shit. Mm. I seen her like... <laughs> oh, okay. Hey, let me let me see that. What y'all talking about? <laughs> nah, nah, nah. Mm. Mm. Okay. So she went in the house, left her phone. Oh, okay. Your nigga just text and called and asked for you. Here Ooh. you go. Why you going through my shit? I ain't have to go through it. The shit just popped right up. I, I fuck with you. Oh man, that's crazy. Deuce. I mean, Dang. I even had like other dudes, and that's the crazy part. I don't ask for none of it. I don't even care. I like if you're gonna be up front with me, be up front with me. Yeah. I've had a situation where a motherfucker made a fake page just to get on her nerves. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> Got oh, on her shit. nerves. <laughs> oh shit! Oh man. <laughs> Is finger, is finger pointing? Oh, Damn, man. shit. They get on her oh, nerves. No. Oh, and, then, man. and then he had hit me. was like, you know. We got to tell this story, hey, though. Let me finish. He was tell like, yo, I, hey, I had to deal because I'm trying, I'm, I'm trying not to have you in the same situation I was oh, in. Oh, man. Yeah, well, you need to watch your back for her. He I'm ca- like, he came to you as a man? Yeah, no. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he came to me as a Worst decision you ever made. Hey, bro, worst. don't ever. Don't come, don't to, me come to me as no man. Don't come to me, bro. Don't tell me. Don't come to me as no man, dog. I'm ever coming to me as a man. <laughs> like, hey, man, I'm he, coming to you as a young black king. Yeah, he never oh, said, oh, man. Man. don't say nothing to her. Yeah, I definitely. Hey, man, why is your ex hitting me up about oh. you? Is this something you need to tell me? I'm, uh, you oh, know what? It's okay. Man. Oh, <laughs> man. No, you got to tell that story, big dog. You got to tell that you story. You made a face. Page, no, 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 no. He didn't. Oh, no. okay. Oh. <laughs> No, 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 no. Because it's because he can't tell his part without me telling mom, bro. You can't oh. tell your part without tell oh, me telling with mom. kick, right? Huh? With kick. Yeah. Okay. No, 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 no. Instagram. I thought it was Instagram. It was kick. It was kick. It was kick. It was kick. Okay. Oh, the app kick. It was remember, kick. Yeah, I remember it kick. It was kick. Yeah, I remember yes. kick. Yeah, yeah. Yes. K I K, right? Yeah. 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 It was the kick. App. So yeah. that's one of the hoest 
Man, text messaging. Man. That's, a dirty app. That's, a, hey, that's a dirty app. That's a filthy. That's a filthy. That's a filthy. I got I got a girlfriend off that app though. That's oh crazy. you did? Yeah, bro. I'm like I didn't have a number, so we was in college. Oh, this was yeah. This was Jaquan. Yeah, I, we, and I kicked her, and then we started talking to each other. So on that's how y'all met? Off like no, we met. Okay, so we met by we used to walk by each other literally every oh, day. Oh, but y'all didn't meet through kick. We didn't meet through kick. Oh, she just okay. gave me her oh, kick. Okay, okay. I'm like, and damn, that she gave you kick, but small she world. Was, that is crazy, but that would have been nuts. But no, nah, we and then she, I kicked her. So what you do, bro? Yeah, yeah. I ain't bro. do nothing. But anyway, <laughs> so my ex, she thought I was like fooling around on her and whatnot. So she made a fake kick mm. and messaged me because oh, she knew I'd be on kick a lot. Yeah, and she messaged me. Damn. She was like, and I forgot what her name was, but it was like a picture of a like a an ass. Yeah. But like like her her side and her ass like going out, but mm. not, oh, man, not she her face. Picture. She was like a side profile. And it profile. said she was from like California. Mm-hmm. Yeah, side <laughs> picture profile. <laughs> this she's from California. She asked me like, "Hey, so and so, this and that, you got a girl?" I'm like, yeah. She was like, "Do you love her?" I was like, "Yeah." Ooh. This and that, just trying to catch me in okay. the lie. And Facts, right? But you, it sounds like you was doing good though. I was like, I'm not. Stupid. So did you pass the. So I listen. passed the test. I'm like, nigga, I know this is you. <laughs> yeah, oh, look, I want to take. Got ass. So I told her in person. I told her in person. Yeah, but here's the okay. So Dan, because I'm the friend of this, I'm the friend of this situation, and so <laughs> she's like, she's like, EJ just broke up with me, and so I'm like, that. and I said, and I said, yeah, and, I said and I said, okay, I said, okay, what did you? I said, what did you do? I said, what happened? And she goes, I made a fake profile. <laughs> And and I sat there the whole and I was in disbelief. I'm thinking, oh man, I said, oh this. So I'm thinking, Eden just. I was like, Eden moved on or whatever. I'm thinking that. He was. She was like, she said, she literally said, hey, I made a fake profile and trying to catch him in the act. And she sent me like the pictures of of the text. Wow. And so I was sitting here and I was like. Good boy. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, good shit. We're gonna. I said we're gonna be friends. I yeah. said. I literally. After hey, that, yo. I said you're not. I said, thank God, you're not stupid. Yeah. I said we don't That's have hard. to have that conversation. We, That's hard, we don't man. have that. Com- we don't we have don't. to have that conversation. I said thank you. But yeah. then I was like, man, well, well, you know, things happen, and you know, y'all are just being a friend, like, yeah, yeah. you know, still being a, still being respectful. I, know one I was of our like, friends yeah, would have lost that test, yo. Yeah. The oh big, man. Big oh, 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 that oh, was a test. He went down bad. Went went down. Down. That bad. was a test. She I wasn't was even testing you. No, she was testing no, him. No, she was testing him. Me. I was oh, okay. testing I'm, him. I'm, and, uh, yeah. So you really did break up with. I don't I did, know if it was we, at that moment, but like he but definitely, yeah. they definitely got into an argument yeah. to oh, where okay. they broke up because she literally say, hit me afterwards. I was about to say if that was really, like if she was started to test a friend too, yeah, she definitely. Oh got no, 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 it wasn't that. It was, mm-hmm. it was not. We were really, really good friends. So yeah. like, and I was in the mix of. You know how you like that friend, friend. Just in the mix of mm-hmm. like a relationship happening. Yep. Mm-hmm. So you're just there on both sides. So I get a call from her, and then I get a call from him, and then yeah, you're, then you're like, really like the and third I'm just, reel of the relationship. I'm, yeah, I'm literally <laughs> sitting there watching television, and, they, and that's how I know they're going through it. Cause like they, she'll call me, I'm like, all right. and then he'll call me. Hey, Shambria called you. <laughs> <laughs> you. Hey yo, I'm like yo, hey. come on, bro. Lord. Oh man. Sorry, well, that's, e. that's awesome. E, you a real yeah, one bro. though. Yeah, bro. Hey, hey you a real ass one. nigga though. <laughs> <laughs> hey, if, if any of you single nah, I'm slim. Uh, <laughs> no, y'all need a real nigga out there. Come to come to EJ oh. page. Man. Oh man, don't do that. <laughs> DM him right now. Right, right now. now. Right now. Yo, <laughs> it's but it's it's super He'll pass funny. the test every time. It's every super time. fun. Every have y'all have y'all ever had any any girls do any tests on y'all? No. You know, like test runs? Any, yes, any? but it was like some nah. high school bullshit. So it, I, anything after in high school, like after I graduated high school, it never happened. It, it, it just never happened anymore. No you're yeah. not. Yeah, okay. You don't believe in high school love? I do. No, nah, I do. School, it was definitely matter of fact. High school sweetheart. Nah, she passed away. Uh, oh, rest I, in peace. Right. Yeah. It, bro, it's crazy. I had a young lady that I actually went to prom with. Mm-hmm. Everything after we broke up, probably like. A uh, year later, she passed away from sickle cell. Oh, mm, so, that's that's crazy. Yeah, that that's sickle crazy. cell is not so nothing to play with like, either. Nothing at, at all. all. Yeah. Nothing at all. That's if, it real. If they got the eyes. It's a it's a high chance that she they got the pass. what? Like if her eyes are different color, like it's like a yellowish, mm. like tint to it or something. Mm-hmm. To, the, <clears throat> to the whites of the eyes, right? Yeah, like yeah. the whites of not actual eye, but 
the white of it, it's a high chance that like she can definitely pass away from sickle cell. Like, I didn't. I didn't know that. I don't know nothing about sickle cell. Yeah, I just know it's yeah. It's like real, people it's that, real. That's real. <laughs> it's, oh, it's, it's crazy. Real. Yeah, man. Like, it's crazy. Cool. But yeah, so that happened, like, nah. But wait, I've she never... didn't test me. But yeah, <laughs> that was like in love. I was in love with her. Mm-hmm. Like, it's, went prom and everything. But what was it? Probably tenth grade. I had a young lady. That's when you got tested. First ever test. Oh, First ever. I didn't even know it was like some test shit out there. I was like, you know, yeah. Oh, soon like the day that we got together, the next day I had like one of her friends hit me up. Oh, you go with her? Yeah. What the f- Who the f- Who are you? Oh, I'm your hunger. I'm your girlfriend. Wait, why is she telling y'all? Oh, okay. So there was a test. Mm. Oh. That's why I get your ass. Right. I mean, that's I'm really talking about what? We were like 15. No, Good that's. Boy. Like 16, <laughs> 16 We got some good old. men. We got some good men. 16 years old. Tom was like, he, 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 he knew what that. He knew. He knew what to say at 16, man. Right. Like, we train. Yeah, we get trained up. Well, I would have fucked all that up. Both of them situations. Is that a side tack? Oh uh, yeah, yeah, nah. And I ain't single. I ain't single today. Bro, like, like, I knew it was fake because like one, it's on kick. You know how kick was. Like bro, you, you don't know nobody on that. Unless it's your friend. That's true. Like we ain't know nobody. Random, in random people. Is that <laughs> random oh, people yeah, message you every day on that thing? Mm-hmm. So like, definitely can. Then you said California. Anybody. Like I'm way in Cochran. I'm all the <laughs> way in Cochran. He in the, he in the, he in the country. He in the anybody suit, that definitely. doesn't know where Cochran, Georgia is, it is nothing yeah, but country. I'm in the woods. Yeah, yeah. you in, in California? Woods, How you find me? Yeah, bro. I'm like, dang, you in California? <laughs> we in California. Just walk outside, big dog. Right. You looking like that? Why are you on kick? Why are you on kick? Yeah, yeah, you should. I have no need to get on kick. Yeah, hey guys, I don't know if any of y'all, some of y'all, are still falling for the foolishness. Hey man, I don't, I don't know how you falling for the foolishness, but stop that shit, dog. If it's a fake profile, just let. Bro, I I got to the point where I leave them on red, dog. It's not right. even a. Oh, man, yeah. it's so many on Instagram, Facebook. Yeah, that, that Facebook. To add me. Yeah, man. Every it's, time it's I get fake. one, I'm like, oh, it's her, it's her. It's all. Yeah, yeah. 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 yeah, bro. It's all. Yeah. She left the mark. Yeah, bro. You know what I mean? I don't know how y'all getting played out like this. Hey, and fellas, if you want to learn how to ace the test, just hit me. I'll help you, bro. Like, I'll, <laughs> I'll help you. Jesus. I ain't helping. I'll tell I you. ain't helping nobody. Bro. You ain't helping you get, nobody. You get, you get caught. You get caught. Unless you my nigga or something. Like that. If you if I fuck with you, then I'll help you out. <laughs> well, other than that, if I know you dumb, fuck you. If I know you dumb, I'm gonna help take your place. If you my dog and I know you dumb, I got to help you. I can't let you go down like that. Yeah, man. Can't let you go down bad. Like, like I'm gonna tell you, dude, you stupid. Listen to me. <laughs> like, come on, you don't do this. Yeah, right, right. But do this, I mean, and you won't right. get shot. <laughs> oh, but cause women nowadays definitely won't go. Yeah, they, yeah, they, they, they applying they for they going, they applying they for they their stabbing and shooting mm-hmm. real quick, real, real quick. Mm-hmm. That's crazy though. That's stabbing wild. And shooting. Okay, so I did get, I did get. Um, I'll tell y'all story real quick before I start the question. So, um, if anybody doesn't know, I do lift. And so during Lyft, I uh, picked this young lady up, um, and we got to conversing over just, like, relationship. Well, we got we talked about the podcast, and then she asked, she was like, were well, you talking about, like, relationships? Um, I was like, yeah, we talk about relationships every once in a while, mm-hmm. just relating and things like that with men. And then she goes, and she's asking, she's like, well, how do you know if a guy is cheating? She's like, do y'all know, are y'all going to talk about, like, how a guy is cheating? Mm-hmm. And I was like, why do you, I was like, why are you? It's like, ma'am, can I ask why you asked me that? Yeah, right. <laughs> and she goes, <laughs> and she goes, um, she goes, she says, well, I think that my guy is cheating. Mm. And I'm like, ooh, we about five minutes from your house, dog. Let's speed this up. <laughs> 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 I ain't trying to get no brother caught hey, up. Hey, I ain't trying to get no brother caught up. But I did ask some Anti-hero. questions. Anti-hero. I'm an anti-hero. anti-hero. Oh, man, I'm an anti-hero. You, you just, you just like, right. like Kevin Samuels. Kevin oh, man. <laughs> no, but I had to ask the questions because so many women... Think that they catch men cheating. Some some women do, and sometimes, bro, you ain't catch shit. You really right. didn't catch. You it. didn't catch anything. Like just facts but, or something. And that's the truth. Like yeah, it's some the story of, some I women, just told. Some women <laughs> literally go through hula hoops to catch men, right. and they find nothing, and they look embarrassing, stupid as hell. And some and the dude mm. is like, I'm now I'm rethinking this relationship because now you have put me in a position where anything that I do. I'm going to feel bad because right. I'm going to go, I'm not trying to talk to anybody. Look, you know what I mean? If we're going to talk about my past relationships, I went to Kane. 
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but, my bad, big dog. My bad, bro. I just listening. He's like, this motherfucker right. preaching, dog. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My bad, big dog. I didn't fly four hours. I did not fly to hear four my hours own diary. To, to, be, <laughs> to hear what I've been through. <laughs> you were just going to put me diary. on display. <laughs> That's no what we going to put. Came right up, dear <laughs> diary. This one, the ENJ right. podcast today. I'm just saying. It's um, the ENJ podcast. But yeah, man. Um, so Yo, I said, wow. I said, hey, ma'am, uh, what makes you think that he's cheating? Mm. And so she tells me a story in which, like, she's like, um, she's like, well, it's only me and him, and he got a new apartment, and so he only pulls out the dishes that you know um, that we need. It's just two of us. So she he pulls it out. Puts in a dishwasher, yada, yada, so yada. So she lives with him or she just She does over. not live with him. He just got a new apartment. Oh, so okay. she goes over to his house to have dinner sometime. Okay. And so uh, she goes over and she opens the dishwasher one day to put the, the stuff in there. And there's already stuff in the dishwasher. And so that was her main That was her main thing. She did go on to say that he's been kind of acting strange. He's not been, like, like returning texts as normal right. and things like this. And you know what? I'm going to ask you. I'm going to go, did you talk to that motherfucker first? Exactly. Yeah. And she goes, no. I have of not talked not. to him. And I said, well, first, ma'am, I get the, you know, I'm a random nigga that you will never see again. But <laughs> at the end of the day, you do have to have that conversation Man. so it's in knowledge. Because, you know, if he is doing it, he's caught. But, <laughs> right. But that's the thing. Any, any, any variation of what we usually do, it comes off as if, we're cheating or doing some like we're doing something mysteriously wrong. Mm-hmm. Like it is have anybody Anything not out noticed? ordinary. Yeah, like ha, but have y'all even right. noticed that right. women women more likely will feed into the negative bullshit before they want to believe that it's before they, especially well, before, they, before they act. Back them right. up. Mm-hmm. Before so, they even act. It's just like we said, like I, I seen a post talking about, you know, men men are so like we hide our emotions so much. Like we can be going through something so bad that we don't tell our women. Yeah. We don't act the same way. Like we don't clean the dishes right away. Or we don't do shit because we so emotional we holding in and then we women ask what's wrong, we be like, none. And then they think it's cheating. And then you think it's cheating. Like, no, it's like I got I got personal shit going yeah, on right? that you and, and, women and will it's not the, and, and for ladies, it's the fact that you bring up the cheating. Like, you bring right. up the cheating first. Like, need, is yeah. there someone else? Is there someone yeah, else? Like, and it's that's like, no, the person that it's like, no, mind? my I'm dude, my like, mom. like, I'm like, like two, I don't know. I'm like two <laughs> seconds from jumping off a cliff. You think I'm worried about... <laughs> Like, I'm you think not worried about, about no woman. Pussy? Right, I'm right. about to. I'm about to end, end me. Right. Like, come right, on, right, I'm yeah. about to end this I'm story. The top you know, bunk. and so uh, and ladies, we we bunk. would want more of a conversation <laughs> to happen. That's what we're saying. Like, hey, I've noticed some things are wrong, or I've noticed <clears> things are not the same. So has anything transpired? If we realize that you are you are coming for help and not to you know like I said attack Hurt, yeah. to attack and things like that you know granted there might be some dudes out there that are cheating but most of the, like I wouldn't say most of the time but I'm gonna say a good bit of the time there is an explanation for it you know what I mean men do go through depressions we're not robots we do have moments in our lives where we're stressed out thinking I'm about I'm literally other depressed right now. <laughs> yeah, as we speak, as we, as we speak, I'm he's thinking smart. of like, fuck, I got so much shit on my mind. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But that's and, why we you know what I'm saying? And some, and some it's, it's real. I'm sure. Yeah. Like, it's, but that's it's, why we're here for you, though. Thank you. Yeah, and that's why we're here for man. you. Yeah, exactly. And, 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 and is Sebastian here for you? And, and for, yeah, all the, here for, you. for all the dudes that are cheating. Don't come to our podcast. <laughs> hey, we don't know. That's don't, and don't try to convince, try to convince your woman that oh yeah, that's what we're going through, baby. I ain't uh, cheating on you, baby. No, no, uh, I would never do that, man. I just got some things on my mind. I ain't trying to. Nah, y'all niggas cheat. <laughs> don't real. come here. Yeah, yeah. Real. So she was asking me. She was like, "How do you how do you tell if a man's cheating?" I'm gonna say. Yeah. I said, "Well, I, I said I have to ask you this one question. That I always ask all women." Why the fuck are you staying if you feel like you are not being valued, you're being cheated on, and things of that nature? Yeah. And I think of myself, and, and if anybody knows me in real life, you know I'm going to end it quick. I will <laughs> not, I'm will not. i not going to sit and allow somebody to, you know what I mean, especially life. Life happens, so yeah. it's so much going on in life. So I'm, I'm the type of dude to tell somebody, bro, if it is not working and you are still declining as a person— you better Just move your bitch leave. ass on b- yeah. before something happens. Just leave. And, yeah, you know what I mean? You can always reconcile or leave. You mm-hmm. get what I'm saying? You can always come back and say, damn, why'd you leave? Well, I felt like you weren't valuing me. And in order to get out of a certain space, negative space in my head, I had to go somewhere else. Right. Mm-hmm. And then that would let the person know, damn, you know, if they were doing wrong, they were doing wrong. If they weren't doing wrong, I'm like, damn, you know, I wasn't thinking about her during that time. 
let me readjust myself. Exactly. You know what I mean? To her needs and, and things of that nature. But that's, again, that starts with having an actual conversation and that actually starts with having an actual, you know, uh, sit down. Open you line two, of communication. Stop going to your Open. friends. Don't go Open. to your friends. Don't, not, go, to, don't go to your friends but all even, the time. Even with or, your mama. Said, nah, like, or your mama. Ooh, or this, your mama. This, this Jesus, this bro. You, now you're preaching. Now you're preaching. Now you're preaching. You're preaching now. Don't go to your mom, dude. Don't, don't, go, to mom, dude. Dude. don't go to mom, dude. It's about mom. your dude. Hallelujah. But it's like you got to, like, women got to give the man a benefit of Given the benefit of doubt that sure. he might actually be going through something personal. Sure. Mm-hmm. They don't ask. They don't. They don't so ask. So if no. you're going to, like, but they don't you, care. Like I say, you got to <laughs> be able to openly talk to the man and be understanding and being like, like, you got to be able to communicate. Like, we was watching some of them podcasts, like the man was saying, uh, you ask a question and you give me a general answer. All right, now I give you a general answer. You're like, I don't understand. Well, hold on, motherfucker. You just gave me the same general answer. Like, yeah. how how we going to be on the same page? We yeah. ain't got to be on the this same page. Like, if I'm telling facts. you this is what it is, don't sit there and be like, well, this was what I perceived it. No, oh, I, I hate you that motherfucking shit. What it is. Well, you're you implying. No, no, the I fuck did not I'm not. Did you hear shit. me? <laughs> I literally said this. I said, and yeah, this that is, is what, what it is. is. Yeah, that is what it is. There's no implying. Stop it. Yeah, bro, I told you. I told you. Because it's, it's the same way. Like, mm-hmm. women were like, I told you to go wash the dishes. Well, I, I it was only one dish in there, so I washed it. It was all them dishes over there. You ain't think to go grab them dishes. You said wash the dish. We are. We are very right literal here. creatures. Like, we yeah, are. it's literal. We can I be went literal. To the sink mm-hmm. and wash the one dish that was in there, because that's what you said. Yeah, you like, tell me to go to the kitchen and grab the fucking dishes off the that's kitchen. The one, that's the one thing in. I tell people all the time. Like, bro, I'm a literal person. I, like, and it might be on. remedial. It, like me, it might be me being retarded. No. But I am a yeah, super... He, this nigga's I'm, definitely I'm, literal. No, bro. Literal. I'm definitely... You got... Like, no, yes. bro. It's been yeah, situations me. where EJ is like... Yo, what the fuck? And yeah. like, you know yeah. what I mean? And I'm like, bro, you have to forgive me. I am a literal. You have to tell, you gotta me. tell me. And sometimes he up. look at me and he's like going step by step. And people are thinking, no, nah, he's talking to no, no bro. He's actually helping me is. out because like, <laughs> I am a literal person. If that's mm-hmm. the if you want a great outcome, especially like you just talk like women want these women want guys to know off the rip what is up. We don't. We don't know what the hell you like. And no. then if that's the case, then no we're going to think about no what the woman before used to like and try to apply it. I, I'm not like the rest of these women. <laughs> well, hell, give me a chance to learn you mm-hmm. and learn what you like mm-hmm. so I can do what you like. I don't yeah. know what the hell you like. You sitting over there quiet. You supposed to know. I, the fuck? Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> my, my old little thing thing, like, her back blown out, so you must like your blown out. Too. Right, so I'm going to do the same moves. Like, what? No, bitch. She, you she want might. me to do something different. She might, though. She, she might. Probably does. Does. But we can't say that. We can't say that. <laughs> we can't say that? We can't say, we, no. Oh, no, we, well, we, we can't. We can't no, I'm not going to. No, I'm not going to say that. My used to like this, so yeah, I thought you would like it, too. No, no, no don't, don't say that. No, don't say that loud. Oh, you trying to end it. Night's over, dog. Night's over. Night's over. Night's over. That pussy ain't, ain't nobody yours getting no pussy. More. Ain't nobody, yeah. ain't nobody getting that pussy. Lock she ain't, she ain't getting but. pussy. She she done locked it up for the night. <laughs> ain't nobody what getting that. Guantanamo oh, Bay. You good, y'all? Uh, Guantanamo Bay. Guantanamo Bay. gonna be locked up. Oh man, like that, like San Quentin. San Quentin. Oh, oh man, he ain't getting in or out that <laughs> motherfucker. Oh, you on the Riker, island? Riker Street. Yeah, Riker, right. Riker, Riker's Island. Oh, Riker Street. I can't go to jail. That's, a, <laughs> that's another thing. I ain't going to jail, dog. You ain't going to jail? It's like we it's oh, like we talk about women, but we, we would never want to go to jail. It's like, nah, I, I, I do anything to stay out of jail. Bro. Anything, big dog. I went to jail for three days, never again. Never again. Never three days? Three days. That was the worst big three dog, days I of my with life. Them. I would have cried with them. I'm not no, I'm not no uh, I ain't uh, thug. I ain't no thug. None of that, bro. I don't want to be in I'm there, big dog. I love my freedom. Yeah, I'm good. Facts. Yeah, I'm good on that. Facts. I I'm telling you, after them day. three days, bro, I said I would never again. I, look, the crazy part, I run from the cops before I have to go to jail again. I, it sounds on crazy, me. bro. I'm gone. But if they tell me they take me, the I'm running, bro. I'm not. Them three days was horrible. You got to catch me. Hey, can can we can we speak on what you went in for? Baby? Oh, yeah, man. I got a little road rage. Look, I'm a little crazy. Nah, I'll just play. He nah, is. Um, he is a little crazy. I, <laughs> that nigga's crazy. That nigga wild. Nah, it was just little roadways minor minor shit, honestly. Mm. Um, like honestly, it was it was so minor that the co- the police at the time could have handled it, either gave us tickets or not gave us tickets, and we both could have went on about our way. But what happened was uh, road rage. So I'm driving down the highway, not even the highway. Um, like what was that? Out in Decatur. Mm-hmm. Drive down the road. 
I'm at the time I had a Nissan Altima, that you know, small ass car. This motherfucker pulled down in front of me in a fucking Bronco. Oh man, OJ. Small OJ. OJ. Uh-huh. Bruh, no real shit. Like OJ fucking Bronco, Dwight white tinted. Oh man, like you man. feel like for real. So I'm driving, motherfucker pull out in front of me, small ass car, big ass truck. And instead, I'm like, you know, you know, like you making them risky ass left turns, and you know a fucking car is coming. Mm-hmm. Instead of them turning and getting the fuck on, they turn and take their time. So I literally had to slam on my brakes. When I tell you, I was probably about this close from slapping the fuck out the back of their car, mm-hmm. and I would have been fucked up because, like I said, I'm in a small ass bron- I'm in a small ass Nissan. Cool. So moving forward, going forward, they kept doing like the brake checking shit. I got road rage. I ain't got time to play. You going on the t-shirt, bucko. Pull the strap out, and I just had it. Oh, got to the light, man. and I had it out the window, pointed down. Literally, like, it's hard. pointed down. So they swerved to the left. It's like, all right, cool. Put it back in. Got the fuck on. Didn't even think about it. Well, I, t- I didn't think nothing of it. Nothing of it. Get to the next light, about to make a left turn. When I tell you, I see two police cars, got them hit the Biggest U turn of my life. Like, I'm talking about tires. Sk- 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 <laughs> Pull the fuck over. Oh, okay. Got over. And all she wrote. So they seen it? Damn. Nah, they ain't even see it. She called the police. Oh. They, they, so they took you for what? What, what was the charge? The charging was pointing and aiming a pistol at another. So they put you in for three days for that? The charge was pointing and Aiming the pistol at another. That's a charge. That's, that's a charge. That's some. They made Swear this shit on the spot. Swear that's a charge. But even, but even so, like you. Swear didn't, that's yeah, a charge. You, but you, yes, they would have to have proof. How, reckless endangerment. Really, How about that? I would say, yeah, I would say like reckless endangerment. Wouldn't that be? Yeah, I would say reckless. When I tell you, I went to court reckless. and the, the judge even said, "Why y'all just didn't charge him for um, disorderly conduct?" Yeah, or something that, like that. that, that you feel me? So, but even even with the said, this is this is how deep the story goes. I'm military, National Guard. I showed my military ID, so of course I ain't doing nothing crazy. When they pulled up on me, I ain't do nothing crazy. They told me to put my hand out, put my hand out. They got me all on film. Apparently the judge seen the whole film and everything, didn't even know. So he was like, you didn't do nothing crazy. You didn't act crazy at the time, and so I don't know why they didn't just charge both of y'all with disorderly conduct. The lady wasn't even supposed to come to my hearing. She was there. She white? No, black. <gasps> I said, I still see this is ass. different. <laughs> this is different. Not only was this like a woman, I didn't even know at the time. Like I said, Bronco, big ass car, Nissan, little car. Didn't even point the pistol at her. Tinted windows. Don't even know who's in there. Okay. She was part of. She was a retired police officer from the cab county. Oh, that's a wrap. So she called her people. She called the cab yeah. county mm-hmm. to come get us. Yeah. We're sitting right there. Mm-hmm. And Rockdale had to come get me because it happened in Rockdale County. Mm-hmm. Oh, she so, sent her people to come get you. Yes. And, and you weren't even in their county? Yes. Oh, yes, man. Yes, did you, yes. Oh, man. Yes. I wish yes. you would have known that. Yes. You yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, no, they I, can't even, they can't they even can't. arrest, they can't they can't arrest you. You. You, can't, mm-hmm. you can't sit there and well, try to charge somebody. No, no not that's what I'm saying. It was the Cab County. It was the Cab County that pulled me over stab, for this situation. If that bitch situation. say the Cab County on your shit, and you and a whole nother, you, they can't arrest yeah, you. Yeah, it was you the Cab County that pulled me over, and it was Rockdale that had to come and get me to mm. take me to jail because it happened in Rockdale. Yeah. I mean, I think they can pull you over. That's a hassle for nothing. Yeah. All that. And even still, both of the police officers, like, you know, what's going on, told them my side. They was like, you pointing the pistol. I'm like, how she know I pointed the pistol? I was like, look at my car and look at hers. How she? How can she say she stared down? She said she stared down the barrel of my gun. Oh man, that's dramatic as fuck. From her bronco. From <laughs> from a bronco. But that's what I'm saying. Like even on a bronco, from you're like buggy. on the other side, and I'm mm-hmm. down low. That means I probably had to like get up, like fuck you. <laughs> like oh, point a pistol like, at him, like <laughs> how the fuck? How? That's what you say. That's what like, you say. That was just like <laughs> fuck, fuck you. Fuck like you, fuck I'll you. kill you. Like what? No, bitch, get the fuck out of the way. Oh, you got away. All right, bet. I got the fuck on. Mm-hmm. I was trying to go home. I just yeah. came from Athens trying to go to Riverdale. Mm-hmm. And it was the quickest way to go through Rockdale. Mm-hmm. Never, I, I I will never again drive through Rockdale. I feel that. Three days ain't worth it. Three days I, ain't worth it. Three days ain't slam. Yeah, I've, I've, I've been blessed not to even touch a jail cell. So yeah. Right. That was <clears> my so, first and last time. No, I would never. I, I can't do it. Yeah, I spent a night. I spent a night in. in no, I can't. I, oh, yeah, well, yeah. 
Yeah, for it. In Texas, this is not legal in Texas. And I had, <laughs> I had an eighth. I just had like a little eighth, and the cop literally took. He said, "If I, I was like, you can just throw it out. If I don't take you to jail, you won't learn your lesson, son." Oh man, I never forget that. That's crazy. I was like, he right though, because I ain't never going back. To that <laughs> I ain't never. Yeah, no, I went to California, then go in Texas and smoke weed. Fuck it. Hey, fuck it. he's like, you're right. Let me go to a you state that's saying? illegal. Hey. Right, instead of dealing with Don't even have to worry man. about it at all, bro. For real. Mm, that's wild. Yeah, yeah but jail's personal. cool, man. They got, you know, sandwiches Check and milk. Up. And, Bruh. That motherfucker. Woke up at 4 o'clock in the morning. Milk? Yeah, that for, little milk cart, little white milk cart. Bruh, yeah. woke up 4 o'clock in the morning for breakfast. That was shitty. Woke up. Yeah. No, nah, not even woke up. Four had to stay up to wait till about 12 <laughs> o'clock for a yeah. fucking sandwich. Not even lunch. Don't lay on your belly if sandwich. you don't know your belly. <laughs> oh, and then man. at Brown's. You had a cellmate? Uh, nah, it was crazy. It was like a bump. It was like... Like, a whole bunch like of in that thing. There's a whole bunch of people. Mm-hmm. Oh, you gin pop, gin pop, gin pop. What you got like a concrete, probably about in between. <clears throat> yeah, bunk beds. Like about two. forty bunk beds. It's in like that four in that four in that square. <laughs> That's it. But you had a bed to yourself though. It, hmm? No, oh, no bunk bed. Oh bunk. That was like it was four in the cell too. So yeah, matter of fact, just like this. You laid on your belly? Hell no. Wait, <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> I barely even went to sleep, right? That was, he that said was, you laid on your belly. was horrible, bro. Yeah, you were gonna feel a you gonna feel a large sausage on your head. Oh man. <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> Never oh, again. Good morning. Thank you. Sitting there until you sleep. Hey, what would you do if, if, that, if you woke up and that was on your head, big dog? Big dog. If I woke, you talking about if I went to jail and I woke up with that on my Yeah, just the dick on your head. Man, I'm going to real jail. I'm going to prison. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you going up under the yeah, prison. Yeah, I got to go up under gotta that. Got to go buckle under the, the jail. Yeah, bro. It's, I'm probably going to carve my name in his chest. Like, that's how <laughs> bad it's going to be. <laughs> oh, I could shit. never, ever. Wake up I did, Yeah, bro. Like, I literally... Bro, it's, it's, it's funny because, like, people say they, they go out of their way to not do anything. Like, I go out of my way to not do anything yeah. that I feel like we'll would get their attention. Here. Of course, like, like like my father's a correction officer, so he's he, we, we've we gone over laws and Georgia laws and, and mm. laws that are pretty much in every 50 states, things like that. So yeah. I have a, I mean, a guesstimation of, like, what not to do and stuff like that, right? So... Um, even when I'm in other states, I'm like, you, know, <laughs> you do that you know if you want to. Right. Right. Yeah, I know how to breathe right. And I think that's mostly, you know, a lot of people's issues. Like, not just black people, but everybody. Like, mm-hmm. people don't know laws. Yeah, we don't know the law. That's yeah, true. We don't, we don't know what we can and can't do. So, mm-hmm. yeah. yeah. But I've never been, like, never been in those type of situations or anything like that. So That's good, bro. Yeah. You're almost, like, 30 and a black man and never been. You never touched it. You an anomaly, right. my nigga. I made it. <laughs> well, I made it 26 <laughs> and I'm never in jail. Yeah, 26 years old. The first time I've ever been in jail. That's mm. really wild. Yeah. Well, we ain't going back, America. Oh, God. We don't man explain We going to run. What? Yeah, I, what? I run. He's the chest. What? Yeah, I'm He's telling you, I'm coming out these shoes. <laughs> Hey bro, <laughs> got a before we before we end this, I do want to talk about Portia Williams. Oh man, we gotta talk about Portia. Y'all know who Portia Williams is? Nah, in, in yeah, like why. yeah, yeah. So apparently she, she is now. Is she dating or is she marrying is that dude? Is she dating? I think him? she's marrying. I think marrying who? She's marrying. Him? I think she. Yeah, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, I hope, you talking about like the woman that was like, dating her friends? Yeah, yeah, that's Portia Williams. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. She's about to marry. She's about to she's marry. She's about bro. to marry him. Yeah. I thought it was just together. She's about to marry Donatello from the Ninja Turtles. She's about to marry Franklin from oh, the fucking. Man. Oh man, what's wrong? What's wrong with that? What's wrong with it though? What the fuck you mean wrong with that, bro? Okay, eat. All right, I go out with a girl, or I even they were married, right? Like the that was his ex. Okay, they were. I'm married. Okay. Ex-wife. Uh-huh. I get an ex-wife. Uh-huh. EJ comes up to me, hey, big dog, I'm about to marry your ex-wife. Oof. That's tough to hear. I don't know how to feel murder about scene, it. Murder scene, murder <laughs> scene. <When it, laughs> I don't know how to feel about it. When it like circumstances. I, I know how to feel. I, I'm bro, saying when the circumstances so let me ask matter. You, this. you mad at me or her? Nope, no, huh? You mad at me or That's her? That's what I'm saying. Like, where's Both the... Y'all, Both of y'all. <laughs> Right. Both of y'all it, getting it. They want to say, is it off the There's strip two that, caskets that is... in my backyard, bro. <laughs> <laughs> and I would expect the same thing. I would expect the same thing. Yeah, and yeah, I, yeah, so yeah. I'm going to give yeah. you, so here it goes. Okay. I'm going to give you one. No, I'm going to give you one. I, I, I need a scenario. I, I need so, a scenario. Okay, bro. so, well, I, I just gave you one. I'm just no, saying specifically, saying like, okay, when the fuck did you, okay, 
if if I'm married, I have uh, an ex-wife. Uh-huh. When did you meet my ex-wife and said I could marry her or date her? When I, I see where I see where you okay. All right. How long? Like how long? And, how and long that's the you, next question. Yeah, yeah. How long have y'all been doing this? Yeah. Right. Yeah. That one, but that one saying I need a scenario because out the strength though. That's Timeline. Your ex-wife. Timeline. Right. That's what you need. Timeline. Still. What? But that's ex wife. So five right. years down the road. That's her best friend, and she's going through. This girl's crying. I, I mean, I'm imagining. But she's married. I'm imagining her ex- getting. Uh, um, she's married yeah. her best friend. Ex husband. Yeah. It's like yeah. one of her. Yeah. Okay. So, yeah. but then what I'm trying to say, so you've never seen them go on dates. She has never talked to you about the man she's t- talking to. You know what I'm saying? Like, for them to now getting married, and that's your when, best friend. So that's y'all what I would ask. you never had no conversation about this man? Y'all shouldn't have. You shouldn't have been having <laughs> any conversations <laughs> like that. Yeah. Like, D, if you're married, friend. there's no way, like, I mean, I'll see your wife. Hey, how you doing, man? We'll be at cookouts and shit. But when is there is a conversation where I'm like, oh, I could really date this motherfucker. Right, right. <laughs> yeah. But that's what I'm saying. So we're never... not, we not talking about this. So now that y'all have divorced and it's, I don't know how many far down the line, but you start to date that. You got to date the person first before you get married. You mm. gotta like nah, nowadays, the, dog. Oh, motherfucker, just get. But she got out. money. But uh, no, nah, I mean, I, I would say people with money don't. move a little bit quicker. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Was, you know what I'm saying? So, like, you know what I'm saying? So even even in between that little small time period of talking, you mean to tell me you ain't never tell your best friend that I am talking to? Well, your I'm pretty sure they had like some side conversation. But even then, I'm beating the shit <laughs> out of Portia. <laughs> there, there, there has to be an ass whooping that is upon her. That's wild. There will be an ass whooping bestowed upon her. And they're not getting... Because all those days you was talking to your husband up? Yeah, bro. Like, yeah, like, you're right, talking to your husband. He's doing this, that. Yeah, and bro. She's like, oh, he's and, doing that, huh? And, you're, and, and that's the thing, too, bro. Like, you're... Y'all are in this... Like, you are broken up over... Like, you're divorced. I'm thinking of a divorce, an actual... Mm-hmm. I don't care if both sides are good. It's a divorce. Yeah. It, nobody's happy at that table. Mm-hmm. Nobody you, is you happy. You never heard one man's... Tr- one man's trash, another man's trash? That applies to you actually going out and getting the fucking not, trash. Not, <laughs> not, not one man. man's best friend. <laughs> is another that man, is another that man's means best you friend. go to best the man. motherfucking... What them big-ass trash cans is outside? You go pick out of that shit. Oh, man. Not the jurors though, but yeah. it is. You returned it to no, bro. That was you. You divorced her. No, no, bro. He took the, <laughs> he took the he took the receipt and returned it to the motherfucker. Got his money back. No, not that. But shit. no, no, no. What makes the situation honestly? What makes the situation bad is the fact that that is the same ring. That's what the, that's, that's what really what the best. No, no, no. That's why everybody's stop, really stop talking playing. about it. That's no, the same ring. Yes, cut that this is. shit off. <laughs> <laughs> that <laughs> that is. That's really Holy what's making the situation shit. bad. Nobody really cares. Like honestly, if you think about, it, nobody really cares I, that they but, are talking. I mean, we do, we do. But if you look at all the blogs and when they're talking about it, yeah, yeah, they bring up a fucking ring. And the ring is, and the yeah. ring is the ex-wife's. Yep. So he using the same wife. I the mean the same, same ring. The same ring. The shit probably the same size too. That's crazy. It's probably so, the same diamonds. Uh, yes. Not the same, you know, band and shit. Cut crazy. that shit off, bro. No. You never know. You never know. But that's it what does, I, that's <laughs> what they posted. Oh, yeah. That's exactly what they posted. She got to fight her. Huh? She got to hey, fight. Fight, huh? man. I got. Honestly, Baby, I got two caskets out in, in the back of my house. You can have them both. I feel like all three of them fucking retarded, honestly. <laughs> I, I like, do too, all three but really like retarded. you can't be the ex-wife and say you're okay with this, dog. Yeah. I mean, you yeah, cannot. She's she definitely not okay with it. She's not okay with it. Not saying like she's okay. Even she if she's not, not coming around and she's saving face because Porsche's a... But no, no they bro. actually all had to sit there. Okay. Get there, like in a video. That's yeah. what I, was they, like, I gotta see the video. Yeah, I didn't see the video, video when they came. All of them came together, and that's what it was like the same ring. Like, they be, yeah, yeah. What's wrong with us? Like, what's wrong with people? Like, but they allowed, they allowed bullshit though. It's cool. This, this is the type of stuff that women allow. Entertainment, allowed, though. dog. It's entertainment. They famous. Yeah, I guess. That's true. Portia needs that's a storyline. Yeah. She don't need no storyline. She got about 12, bro. Kenya, Kenya gave her one, bro. Like, <laughs> so. Kenya gave her a storyline. She the villain. <laughs> she the villain. A fucking anti-hero. <laughs> hey, hey. That's a villain. That's that's Lex Luthor. Right Shout there. out to all the male anti-heroes yeah. out there for us. You know, yeah, we'll, we'll tell y'all one day. What, that's what gonna the, be, that's gonna be but so Shout out to the male anti-heroes. I don't know why they call me an anti-hero. I'm definitely not, a, <laughs> not an anti-hero. Nah, it was what you just said that made it like yeah, an anti-hero. It was what you said. It was <laughs> what I said that made it anti-hero? Yeah. Oh, man. Hey, it's all right. I'm a good guy. You're like Deadpool. 
That's kind of hard, huh? That is hard, like though. That. Deadpool yeah. is hard. Deadpool, Deadpool is hard. He's just trying to make everybody laugh. That's it. Even if he is trying to kill you. That's Fact. right. So you're going to die in the midst of You're going to die right. in the midst of like a... I feel like that's what I want to die like. Laughing. You laughing, yeah, yeah, definitely. Either that or watching Sports Center in my house, just like passing out. <laughs> just pass away watching Sports Center. LeBron? That's the last thing No, see. not LeBron. <laughs> <laughs> not LeBron. Scott Eddie. Yeah, Scott. <laughs> Damn, you crazy. see him dunk for the last oh. time, and then it's like, ooh. Before we get out of it, shout out to the Lakers for winning. You know, the who? Shout out to the Lakers for winning. Oh, the two, Hawks. Two are the Hawks winning yet? Hawks Hold on, are, check. We're currently winning. We're currently winning at shout the out recording. Shout out to my guy Trey Young. Shout out to Trigger. my guy. Yeah, Trey shout out to Trey. Shout out to Trigger Trey. And shout out to all them guys, dog, because like y'all are playing. Yeah, they won. Hawks won. All right, Hawks won. So as we speak on that, I know we we about to cut out, right? Yeah. yeah. All right, I just want to say. As a player, as a basketball player, not, I mean, I ain't, well, no, nah, I'm still a player, fuck that. As a basketball player and also a fan of the game, if you spit on a player oh. or you do anything negative to a player, I personally want to whoop your ass. I feel like, no, nah, bro, I feel like the NBA should let them go into them stands. And whoop that motherfucker Because, like, ass. it's, because, it's, uh, come on, bro. Huh? Yes. I think. It's fan. literally a video. No, no, there's fans literally, literally, literally spitting on people, bro. bro. They're pouring popcorn on you? And also, and also on top of that, yeah, we got... Westbrook, one of the most disrespected NBA players that just broke a record for the most triple doubles. And he he got hurt, and on his way out, he got popcorn spilled on him. I would want to whoop his ass. I think you. I think you should, I bro. Whoop his ass. I think you should to let. Too, bro. I think it, six it, niggas no. holding him back. Yeah, yeah, bro, that, that was like yeah, that was a starting lineup holding him back. Yeah, 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 it was another no, malice in the palace he, coming. I, I, all them better be lucky he ain't have a running start. So that motherfucker is swole. He's strong. He would have pushed these shit out of all of them. Got up in this thing. And that's and that's my thing too, bro. I just don't like. And I don't know if it's quarantine or whatever, bro. That's to- totally it's different. They're, they're, you're talking about the the racist remarks that are coming from the stands and, and it's, all it's, that it's, stuff. It's, it's real aggressive. Right it's now. real aggressive it's right real. now, bro. It's and like real. it's mm-hmm. like they've been waiting to get in the stands just to just fuck to, some yeah, shit up. Some shit yeah, up. bro. Like, you know and it's that? getting and it's getting weird too. Cause like I said, spitting on folks. That's, like you like yo you oh, yeah, bro. You need your run me mine. And honestly, and I commend Trey Young. I, he probably didn't know he got spit on. I don't think he knew. I don't think he knew. But I commend Trey Young. I think Derrick Rose seen poise. that shit though. Yeah, he definitely saw that shit. There, I commend Trey Young on his poise. When well, he was walking to the locker room or walking out of the locker room? No, he was, no, he was on the court. Like, he was on the court, like, like about to take the ball out or yeah, something like that. Yeah, and Trae like Young you was literally on the court. see yeah. the guy in the back, like say something, say something, pull his mask down and spit. The girl was sitting down in the row, just like, oh, what oh, the fuck? Forget that game, though. I'm in the stands. Well, I'm saying, I commend Trey Young because I don't even think he noticed that. He didn't even think he noticed He didn't even move. He didn't move, bro. You you know if you'd have felt something wet and you move, he would have moved yeah. instantly. He must have hit a boy, straight jersey then. Why I had would to hit straight jersey? The dog shit out there, man. I w- I don't understand the what's going shit. on with people, bro. People the are so weird, shit. bro. That is, that is assault. They talk about banned him from the arena. No, he needs to go, go to jail. jail. Yeah, he and has if to go he to go to jail. jail. He need to get his ass whooped. I'm letting oh, my right. team. Hey man, my, my co- hey, my, if I'm the coach, dog, I'm letting them motherfuckers fight. I'm telling you, like it's they, one thing to fight a dude because of some bullshit on the court, but no, right, bro, you pl- throwing shit at me and spitting on NBA me. NBA players got to go through so much already. Yeah, they getting paid millions or whatever, whatever. But you got to sure, understand, any pro it's a lot really, that dog. comes with it. You got to yeah, act man. a certain way. You got to be a certain way. Yeah, they got to be professional. They got to have times. interviews. Like they can't. It's like them trying to skip an interview. They get fined. Yeah. Like what? I get fined for not wanting to talk. You? What the fuck? I'm on here, so I won't get fine. Right. <laughs> so I'm that's some true shit. That's crazy. That's some true shit. Shout out to Marshawn. They actually have to go through that stuff. And then just to come out, you playing a game, and you get spit on, and yeah. you get... Yeah, it ain't never that deep for me, bro. Bro, I'm ready to fight now. It's disrespectful. It's disrespectful. Shout out to Westbrook. Shout out to Trey. Yes, yeah, shout out to Westbrook. Sorry that, that happened to you guys. Yeah, man. It's crazy. It's crazy. Let's, let's be better, NBA fans. Like, what the fuck? People. Be good people. Just be better, bro. What be the fuck? better people. What the fuck wrong with y'all? <laughs> Give respect, receive respect. They let y'all back in the goddamn. Mm. This is what y'all were paid to win? Right. right. Come on. Yeah, I ain't been outside in a long. I want to spit on you. Yeah. It's almost like I came they've to the been waiting with... for it, bro. Like, yeah. I guess, I mean, being home, everyone's all built up tension. So now they feel like, look, look, they feel You're the blood. You're not in the bubble no more there, Every, buddy. The animo- the motor, you know, everybody's pumping the, the crowd, the, you know what I'm saying? The drilling. And so niggas just like, I'm spit. Like, hey, yeah, hey, like, it's probably, it's probably, they probably had worse experiences than just getting spit Oh, no, nah, I mean, I'm pretty sure. I mean, we've you heard over the years, like, even but like the players come out and tell yeah. Yeah. you know what I mean? Real. Even like, um, I think Kyrie came out and was, you know, he alluded to like, you know, racial. 
attention. To a mm -hmm. Well, racial like remarks coming from the crowd of and course, stuff like bro. that. So of course. Oh, it's wild. It's wild as shit, man. But shout out to the NBA guys, man. I'm sorry y'all have to go through that bullshit. Yep. Yeah, weirdos. Ooh, fucking um, weirdos. But yeah, man. Um, that is a week for us. Boom, boom, Appreciate y'all staying yes, through, sir. man. Appreciate you guys coming through. Another like, one in the book. Another one in the books. Like, like, like comment, subscribe. Yeah, yeah. And all that good shit. All that good shit. Yeah. Yeah. All share it with your shit. friends. Yeah. Yeah. Shit, Share it with like, your exes. You like our swag. Say something about it. Yeah, Say something you like Chico? It. If you like my boy Chico over here. Chico. Dun, 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 no, dun, yeah, yeah, yeah. Dun, 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 Chico. Money bag E over here, money dog. Bag money e. bag E, e in the building. Yeah, money, money bag E. e. Hey. 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 Dropping hey. dimes on Dropping dimes on I'll tell you, bro. Coins. 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 Quarters. Let's go. But yeah, man, appreciate you guys, man, and we're out of here, man. Yeah. Appreciate that. Yep.